And on the heels of that call, we get ourselves a little four-on-four -on, -four on the ice. Doesn't take much for this four-on-four -four to turn into chaos. One missed shot, one rim around the boards, and it's chaos. Here's the pass down low. Their man's now out of the box, and they'll take advantage on the power play. And manages to clear the zone. The Nighthawks have it against the wall. Pass to Seidenberg. Moves it to Keith. Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. The Nighthawks glided along the line. And now he moves it quickly to Vaji Holahi. And that goes off a player in front. The Icebreakers get a hold of the puck under man. Picked up along the boards by Lee. Domi's up and ready to join the play. Time's up for the power play. Both teams back to equal strength. Always frustrating for the power play when they go back to the bench and don't have anything to show for it. Feeds it down low. Can't make it work. From the point, turns it away on the slot wow. shot. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. Domi's going off for interference. The Nighthawks send their man advantage unit out once more. Haven't had a lot of power plays tonight, but when they jumped over the boards to come out for the draw, they were huddled together having a little meeting to make sure they're on the same page. Tims plays it now. Manages to hang on. Handles the pass. Along the half wall with the puck. Can't connect as it goes off a stick. The Icebreakers gain possession along the wall. The Nighthawks look to start the transition game. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Gets the puck in deep. The Nighthawks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. The Icebreakers' PK unit delivers on that. One-on-one -on -one with the goaltender. Let's get the call. He's wearing out the ice. He's been going back and forth to the penalty box all night long. The Nighthawks once again send out their power play unit. They've got great puck skill on this power play. What's available, I think, is the cross crease one-timer. From the point, they take control of it. And he makes the save on that play. The Nighthawks have it behind the net. And they get the puck out of the defensive end. From the point, looks to make something happen. The Nighthawks have the puck now. Drives to the paint! Scores! And they converge with the man advantage! That power play is so dangerous. The puck starts zipping around. It ends up in one of a couple different options. They don't miss very often. The Nighthawks get on the board first, and they now lead 1-0. That's good execution from them, James, after a pretty tight first half of the period. Now they can play from in front. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. The Nighthawks scoop it up along the boards. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. The Nighthawks get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Seidenberg's got it in the offensive zone. And now he tries to get it across to Breezy. Save made by the goalie. Goalies love the butterfly. They know they've got a lot of the net covered, so he slides across. Doesn't worry about this shot. Grabs the puck. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. Circles back to center ice. Tosses it on to Seidenberg. The icebreakers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Shuts him down. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Domi's known to play the game hard and heavy. His truculent zone ability means he likes to body opponents off the puck with a hard hit. Breezy's able to steady his team defensively and still contribute points. I'm expecting one of these two players to be the biggest impact for their team tonight. Back to you guys. And that pass doesn't go. Pass across to Dixon. The icebreaker's gonna work on offense. Takes it at center. 
two on one. What an opportunity here. And makes the routine save. Effective save there. You make the stop, yes, but that puck's in the corner where there's no danger now. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Sends a pass over. And he lowers the boom there. He's got a little jump. beats the goaltender. I think the goalie felt it. he was in the perfect position. He didn't really move too much, but just inside the post. Keith won the draw here in the neutral zone. Broken up with a stick. Moves it quickly over to Domi. And that's blocked from someone in front. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. The Nighthawks in possession in their own end. And the save. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. A oh, tight game like this. You just want to limit the damage so you can get to the intermission. They've used this 1-3-1 set earlier in the game to some success, so they'll go back to it. They can use the bumper spot, the wings to create the shot, and you always have traffic in front of the net. There's a chance in front. Pinned up along the boards. Dished on over to Dixon. Dishes it to Seidenberg. That concludes period number one. I cannot believe they got one of the all-time great 90s hip-hop acts getting set to play for the fans here in this intermission. I can't wait for this. We'll come back at period number two. It just... recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Oh, don't ignore that, James. I don't know if it sounded big where you were. It is now, I'm telling you. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. And he makes the save. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. This is always a fine line penalty. You're allowed a little interference, just not that much. into the zone with ascendant zone ability. The long breakout pass can create a great counterattack and really set his teammates up for success. Keats gained possession and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. I wasn't sure if anybody was going to be able to start to change the momentum of this tight game. Pretty clear the goaltender's not expecting this shot. That defensive zone turnover results in this quick shot. Beats the goalie low. Keats won the draw. Penalty expires and the PP unit gets set to go to work. The icebreakers move the puck in the defensive zone. Gets it over to Tim. Oh, what a big hit on the play. Scores! And there it is!
it's a power play goal. You don't see many off the odd man rush, but that's a breakdown penalty killing that gives up this opportunity, and they don't miss. Good puck movement, and then the finish is beautiful. The icebreakers have now gone ahead by a pair here in this second. Stretching out the lead here in the middle frame gives you a little bit more flexibility on the bench. The coach can use his whole lineup. Grabs the puck at center. Here's a short pass to Domi. The Nighthawks have it from their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Play is blown dead with the offside. Lots of time left in this period. The Icebreakers have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Wilson's gained possession inside the neutral zone. And the puck leaves the zone. Picked up along the wall by Keith. The Icebreakers take possession in the defensive end. Now a quick pass to Timms. Oh boy, here's trouble. Two on one. Oh, and he whiffs. Let's see what the officials are calling. Breezy's getting called for slashing. As we're about to drop the puck, power play unit back out onto the ice for another opportunity. Sometimes it's just your night, and the way that they've performed on the power play, it kind of feels like they're going to get another one. Passes on over to Dixon. And that's offside, stopping the play. Seidenberg's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. The Nighthawks get a hold of the puck off the draw. And it's a quick pass to Vaji Holahi. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. Quick feed to Dixon. Gets the glove on it to make the save. Lindblom's been sharp stopping the puck tonight. He's got a really good save percentage, and his team's done a good job at the offensive zone as well. Penalty coming up here. I thought I'd noticed him being a little cautious after taking that early penalty. It doesn't help. He's in the box again. The Nighthawks take possession off the faceoff. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. Feeds it over to Wilson. The Icebreakers played along the boards. Quick pass across to Seidenberg. In all alone! Oh, did he overthink it? Did he ever? I mean, he ends up almost in a position you can't even get the puck to the net. That's just too much time and too many thoughts. Nothing really decisive about that play. Keith sliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Here's a feed in front. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Sends it over to Seidenberg. His energy's been off the charts. He is looking to finish a check every time he's on the ice. The Nighthawks are back to even strength here. These are the power plays that drive coaches crazy. They didn't really generate anything. They didn't force the penalty killers at all. Kind of a waste of time. Slides the puck to Wilson. Slides the pass over to Seidenberg. Here he is in front. Oh, and he skates out as he gets a piece of it with the glove. He swallows that puck up as he slides across in the butterfly to make the save. And a good save on the play as action continues. Taken by Wilson. And now he moves it to Domi. Can't get a hold of that pass. This is a relentless shift. What great energy as they pour it on. And now he angles it across to Wilson. And this... Scores! Took a weird bounce off his skate and past the goaltender. The Nighthawks are back to center ice, and they have narrowed that gap. Cut the lead in half. The comeback's on. Now they must push forward, see if they can get the equalizer. Scooped up along the wall by Lee. Slides the puck ahead to Timms. From behind the net, looks to break out. The Icebreakers have it against the wall. Comes up with the stop! I think he got a blocker on that one! Grabbed along the board by Keith. And he 
takes the feed. The Nighthawks looking against the half wall. Can't make the connection on the pass. Here's a shot with the stop. Slides the puck down low. Denies him again. Tremendous intensity here in the offensive zone. Here's the pass. That's off target. And the D comes up with it. That's moved up ahead. Quick pass to Lee. And the extended stick ends that one. Here's a sprint for the loose puck. And we'll reset things after that icing. He's going to try and shake this off and get back into the game, but he took a heavy hit there. Late goings of this period. The Nighthawks still trail by a goal here, but they are back into this one, only down by one. Patrick Hula, he's got in the offensive end. Oh, the referee's going to call that one. Takes a shot. Let's see what the officials say. I know the killers are going to get to work here. No matter what happens, James, the coaches are going to have to reset the guys at the break. Time for the power play unit to get back to work. Great opportunity to get this game back to level. A power play trailing by one. This is a huge opportunity. Denies him. He got all of it. Puts it on now. Denies him on the play. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Centering feed. He scores! What an opportunity and delivers! The Nighthawks have evened things up here late in this second period, and it looks like they've got a little jump in their legs now. Well, they've shortened the game out now. You go into the intermission, hopefully tied, and you've got to run at it in period three. Puck moved over to Tim's. Shot! All right, that brings the period to an end. Ray and Carlin both off to get some poutine from the concessions. I'm going to grab some popcorn, and we're coming back with period number three in moments. Welcome back, James Sabalski, ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. It's been quite the night of fireworks thus far. Let's see what this third period can do to keep up. Denies him in close. He's been really good on these high danger chances, and here's another one right from the slot, but he's tracked that puck to keep it in front of him and make the save. Stoppage in play, offside the call. Lots of time left in this period. We are all tied up in this one. The Nighthawks win it. Big hit on the play. He's not missed many of these. Every time he gets the puck, they seem to target him. And he's not been able to elude anybody. Moves it to Keith. Lee's picking up steam. Moves it to Seidenberg. They've got numbers here. A chance. Love safety. It's in the back of the net, but it's not going to count as the whistle goes before the puck went in. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. Wilson's won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Tims gains the line and into the offensive zone. The Nighthawks get a hold of the puck in their own end. The icebreaker's ready to go on the attack. Can't connect on the pass. Scoops up the puck here. Grabs control of it at the point. The goalie's best friend comes up big again as it goes off the outside of the frame. 
So close to jumping into the lead, that shot hits the goalpost, and the game will remain tied. Sets the pass down low. The icebreakers gain possession. Costs it up in the neutral zone. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. The Nighthawks cross the line and gain the zone. Picked up along the boards by Wilson. Grabs it in his own end. And that's knocked away. Tries to get the puck to Vaji Hulahi. Poked away. Moves it quickly over to Keith. And he takes the feed. Rocks him on the play. Tries to feed it over to Seidenberg. Moves it to the middle. Shot! The icebreakers gain control of the puck. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Keith. You'll need more than that to beat him. Here he is in close. And that goes off a stick somewhere in traffic. Carla Bade is standing by with who she thought had the better performance. Breezy's looked good tonight, guys. This was a tough choice because the players were tied in points, but I thought he stood out a little more in this one. Throws it on net from there. And that somehow stayed out of the net. And sends it just out of reach. Icing is the call. We'll get a reset. Lee's known for intercepting pucks in order to transition from defense to offense, guys. That's his quick pick zone ability, and it's his read of the play that helps him turn things around for his squad. Fatra Hulahi's lugging the puck. Couldn't make the connection on the play. The icebreakers take it along the wall. Came up with a nice save. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Well past the midway mark of this period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. We got a delayed penalty coming up here as the ref's hand goes up in the air. Lindblom's great in the butterfly position, guys, and even when he's down, he maintains mobility to move with the play to make the save. That's his butterfly effect zone ability. And there's a little boost from off the wing as the centers were tied up there. And the puck escapes the zone, and they'll be forced to tag up. Great poke check on the reach. Here's a short pass to Keith. Nice feed from the right wing. Quick feed to Vaji Holahi. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. The Nighthawks have it now. 